In Hi everyone, today I'm gonna show you how to make coconut oil but first I'm gonna introduce you to someone that is can you see your name? Tyron that is Tyron Basfield he's my nephew So first, what do you have? Uh, what do you need to make some coconut oil? You ha you need like uh, ten of these, like a big of big bowl of these uh, coconut. So actually, coconut is a fruit, and uh, it's uh, the whole year it's uh, giving fruits, right? Right, Tyrek? Okay, he must he must speak also, right? He must say something. Okay, then. Uh, what we gonna do next we gonna chop it in this uh, food processor yes chop it in this food processor and because of this because this food processor is um, is uh, small uh, First, we're gonna slice it in little pieces like this. Yes, little pieces like this. Yes, Tyron? Do you want to do it also? What do you want? Cornflakes. Do you want cornflakes? Okay. I'm gonna. Yes. Just, this is a big um, coconut slice. So, we're gonna chop it in small slices right and when it's done uh, it's gonna be like this uh, blend and we add like uh, we add water to it so we can have the extract of it and then we we make coconut milk yes out of it here I have put uh, water in it so it becomes uh, coconut milk and because of there are a lot of um, still coconut uh, particles in it I have to uh, pull it out with this uh, sieve and you see just with my hands to make sure there will be no uh, particles left of the coconut itself so if you can do this at home it is so helpful because uh, in the stores um, they usually sell coconut oil but uh, I'm not sure it's the pure coconut oil so I tend to make my own coconut oil not to buy in the supermarket so you see there's uh, this bowl has a lot of coconut milk and this milk I'm gonna put it over in something else this is like uh, coconut oil actually it's coconut oil i'm gonna let it sit for a day and tomorrow i'm gonna uh, process uh, further so we have to wait for a day to begin the next process of the making of coconut oil 
so yesterday I I put the coconut milk in this box and now I'm gonna open it after one day you see the the oil actually get on the top of it of the water so you know if you know chemistry oil is lighter than water so it's gonna float and this I'm gonna put in the preheat uh, preheat wajan so we call this wajan after a while of cooking it you can see the oil appears the moisture of water uh, disappears so now all of the water has evaporated in the wajan so what you see now is coconut oil and I'm gonna pour it later when it's uh, cooled down. To the result of uh, making coconut oil, you saw that I have boiled the coconut milk. I've left it for a day. Um, then I've cooked it, and this is the this is the result of it. You see, uh, it has the great texture. It has the of a color a little of gold color brown gold color and if you smell it it's it's pure one of the benefits of coconut oil is that it is good for your skin it's also good for your heart it has the beneficial um, let's see fatty acids and it's good uh, for your whole uh, digestion um, it reduces hunger so you you don't get uh, a hunger uh, any any moment uh, you don't get hungry any moment and um, I can see that uh, uh, lately coconut oil is now uh, expensive in Suriname I don't know in other country but uh, coconut milk uh, coconut oil is one of the one of the uh, plant-based oil and is uh, good for your health I made one liter coconut oil for one liter I needed 10 uh, coconut fruits um, this is very rare because uh, a couple of months ago I needed 20 of them to make this much uh, coconut oil but uh, I don't know maybe those fruits were kind of big so um, I'm glad I've made uh, one liter and a quarter a quarter of uh, oil so if you haven't subscribed to my channel yet please subscribe leave a comment uh, what do you think about this video and uh, press on the sub uh, on the like button all right okay thank you for watching guys this is me making homemade coconut oil